How's it going everybody? It is a beautiful Saturday today. Um, a little windy, but nice temps. Um, I'm out at one of the farms looking for once again another specific antler. Um, uh, the deer is a three and a half year old eight point. Um, I have his match set from him at two. And just the way this this deer is, I think he's got the uh, the potential to be a 150 inch eight point at five. So that's what I'm hoping. Um, that's why I'm out here trying to find his sheds. But we're gonna do some walking and I will let you know what I find. All right, guys. Um, I just went to another spot here at this farm. Um, usually don't find sheds over here, but um, I honestly did the majority of the good stuff. So I'm going to start knocking down these less likely spots. All right, guys. I do not believe it. This might be the four-year-old eight's match set. I think I can see a busted G3, and I think it's him. Oh, maybe not. Oh, I am pumped. No, it's not him. But it is a match set. It dropped early, I think. Awesome. That is shed number seven and eight. Yes, I just probably walked, I probably walked like three, four miles. And I've never found a shed in here, but here lays a match set. Yes. So I'm gonna leave that one there. I'll grab this one. There we go. Beautiful little match set. Yes, second match of the year. Yes. All right, right there made my day. Hopefully, um, we can find a couple more. That would be awesome. All right, guys, I don't know why I do this to myself. As a crow flies, I'm 1.6 miles away from my truck right now. Um, and the sun is going down on me, so... Yeah, I'm gonna keep looking on my way out and hopefully we can at least find one more. All right, so just still the match set. Um, taking this fence line up and over all these rolling hills back to the truck. I'll map it out when I get back, but I think I probably did about five miles all said and done. All right, guys, so almost back to my truck. It's getting dark and uh, remember when I picked these up, I thought it was the four-year-old eight with the busted three because this was just the way the antler was laying it looked like uh he had a busted g3 but um i just found the four-year-old eight with the busted g3 my truck is right over this hill there's just a kind of thickish kind of thick uh waterway and i stop right here and the first thing i see is the busted g3 um, this deer shed so early, it was still in season. So, hopefully, his match is somewhere right here. But there he is. What a toad. Yeah, that is a solid antler. Long main beams. Oh, that is awesome. I filmed this deer so much this year. Awesome. Hopefully his match is somewhere in here. Um, I don't got a lot of daylight, but we're going to try anyway. All right. I don't think I'm going to find it. Um, so I will be back in here tomorrow for sure. Um, and we, I still got a lot of ground here that we haven't covered. So definitely going to be in here tomorrow. So just subscribe, stay tuned. Um, and we are just going to continue to pile up the antlers until green up. So make sure you subscribe, turn on that bell, and I will see you on the next one. God bless.